the end of the 19th century, humankind is burning coal and oil and gas and so on. During the last 200 years, CO2 emissions rise constantly. The more carbon dioxide we have in the atmosphere, the more the atmosphere heats up. This will cause entire ecosystems to collapse. And causing extreme weather events, floods, desertification of regions. And animals and people will suffer from that. My name is Reto Tamburini and I studied energy and environment within the Master of Science in Engineering. Since I was a child, I'm aware of our high energy consumption. When I was in first or second class, I tried to develop an electric car. My father built wind turbines by himself. This is what he did for 50 years or so. And I'm working on these topics for more than 25 years now. So um, I cannot hold back when it comes to energy and environment. I want to directly work on new technologies which will bring humanity further and for a cleaner and better environment. Rito and I, we are really terrified by the climate change that is happening all over the place. My advisor and I were screening for technologies to remove CO2 directly from air. I was reading the IPCC report and the IPCC says that we should plant trees to reduce carbon dioxide. The problem with trees is that they are growing relatively slow. And at the same time, we read an article that microalgae in warm water, given the nutrients, carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and so on, grow like crazy. We thought instead of planting trees, we produce biomass with microalgae in warm water. At the beginning, I was carrying out experiments at home, as my advisor did. We have a close collaboration between student and advisor. In the case of Rito Tamburini, we are really working together. And this is really fun to work with the students, developing new ideas, new products and so on. After those experiments, we experienced that we have to go a step further. We asked uh, Lucerne University of Applied Sciences to support us, and this is exactly what they did. So we were able to build laboratory reactors. We were able to use laboratories and facilities. So I think it's really fascinating. I think more or less one year ago, this was just an idea that more or less came out of thin air. And one year later, we are working in the lab and producing real microalgae biomass already. Studying the Master of Science in Engineering was definitely worth it. I was able to acquire an enormous amount of new knowledge. I think that Lucerne University of Applied Sciences really offers a, a supportive and encouraging environment. If you want to uh, implement real, tangible projects, Lucerne University of Applied Sciences is the way to go.